Well, hello, my fabulous friends. I hope you're doing well. I'm going to read on how the flopples feel about getting the HRH officially off the website because, you know, they're all about the website, right? How come you haven't put the kids, prince and princess on the website? How come you haven't done this? How come you haven't done that? Push, push, push. Well, the palace pushed back and took their HRH off the website. So let's see how they're feeling about that. Let's get the general energy around the HRH being officially removed from the website. And of course, I'm using the pulp tarot when I talk about these two. So how do, and I call them the flopples now because everything they, they touch flops. Um, how do uh, Harry and Megan feel? What's the energy around that HRH being removed from the website? How do they feel about that HRH? How do they feel about that HRH being removed from the website? What's the energy of now that it's that 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 energy is kind of settled and they realized what it means? Uh, what's going on there? And maybe what's the real reason that HRH was finally removed? What's the real reason that HRH was were was the palace worried that that new PR guru would start to use it somehow in marketing or? Puff pieces, were they worried that somehow it would be used? Plus they were moved to the bottom of the page, just above Prince Andrew. Um, <laughs> I wish they would have put, 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 put them below <laughs> Prince Andrew. <laughs> that would have been good. Come on, Palace, step it up. <laughs> put a smile on our face. We deserve it. We deserve it. Harry and Meghan, the energy around the HRH being erased from the website, from the royal website. HRH being erased from the website. Cards are ready. Ooh. Ooh, three of cups. They are not happy at all. Three of cups in reverse. The party's over. The party is over. Three of pentacles. Now they have to come up with a new plan. I told you the the palace is, is probably heard through the grapevine that they were going to use the HRH. And I'd like to point out three and three and HRH is three. So now they have to come up with uh, a whole new plan. They were planning to use it. Oh, yeah. They were going to show that the queen, Queen Megan, HRH, mother of the year, Instagram um, wife of the year. Instagram abuser of the year. Well, that's what my, my cards, my sources say. Queen of Pentacles in reverse and the tower in reverse. Oh, this was, I'm going to say it right now. I think Catherine was behind this going, hey, look at pointing finger. Hey, hey, their HRH is still up there. Their HRH is still up there. They can now, they, I bet Megan will try and use it. But the tower here and the three of cups in, in reverse, I bet it was uh, Catherine. And also this could be uh, the late queen. She was the one who originally removed them, wasn't she? And said they weren't allowed to use them. Um, so this could be a combination of Catherine going, hey, didn't the queen tell say that their HRH titles are gone? So why are they still up on the website? I think they're slowly removing everything. I think this is the, the beginning because the tower in reverse is a slow moving train crash. You, you can watch it in front of your eyes happen. And I think we're going, I think this is the beginning. The three things are going to be removed. The, this is big plans so that Megan can't use it. I, th I still think. I think Catherine had something to do with this. Seven of Cups. Oh, yeah, look, at they're coming up with a new plan how to spin this, how to gaslight us that, you know, they asked for it. They wanted the website to be corrected. I know. That'd be hilarious if they came out and said, yes, we know the HRH is removed. We're the ones who pointed it out. We're the ones who pointed it out. Uh, and to so that everything is correct and everything is above board because you know we just want we have all this integrity and we want to be transparent and it's all gaslighting and confusion and four pentacles um they know this is going to cost them money they know this is going to cost them money um i think this is them hanging on to everything they've got they're trying to hang on to what whatever's left. 
Three of Swords. Yes. Three of Swords upright. You're damn right, this was Catherine. She has been betrayed by them and she is <laughs> she's quiet revenge. You know, they always say Scorpios are the best for revenge because it's a revenge is a dish best served cold. I think Catherine's got quiet revenge. I wouldn't want to piss her off, would you? I think Catherine is like, you, I'll get you. Might not be today, might not be tomorrow, might not be next month. Somehow, some way, and you won't even know it's me. You won't even know it's me. The devil. This was <laughs> on top of the Empress, four of pentacles, three of pentacles, and the seven. Yes. She was she was planning to use it. And I think Pallas caught wind of it somehow. Remember, I've done a reading. In, uh, somebody asked in the Q&A, is MI6 and MI5 watching Harry and Meghan? And the answer was absolutely yes. So I think they picked up on some kind of intel that they were thinking of using the HRH. Um, I, at least Megan was. At least Megan was thinking of using the HRH in some respect and uh, to, to make some money. Uh, because she wanted to show she was the queen. And uh, this is, uh, uh, and Catherine, um, maybe Catherine has been pushing it for a while. But it also is the betrayal of the queen. That's why sometimes it's really hard to read. Um, uh, because they were both queen of pentacles. And um, the queen is certainly not the empress anymore because she's passed and there's a new empress. Um, th but this actually could be the be, be the echo of the betrayal of the queen here, especially with temperance here. And it could have been something that um, Catherine just kept pointing out, going, yeah, this needs to be done. This needs to be done. Um, these two need to be balanced out. Interesting, the, de the devil and temperance is the angel. So we got a real, we got Megan against Catherine. That's another reason I think. It, this is Catherine on this side. Queen of Cups. Queen of Cups. Was it Camilla? <laughs> Was it a combination between Camilla and uh, and Catherine? I and mean, look at them drinking their tea. I know sometimes I say this is Diana, but I don't think Diana had anything to do with this from beyond the grave. I think this is we're talking about people in the here and now. And uh, and plus, and actually, Queen Camilla is now the Empress because Charles is the Emperor. So yes, this is this is Camilla. This is Camilla. I know some of you don't like to hear that, but it's true. She's the Queen of Queens right now. Um, one day Catherine will be the the Empress. She she'll, and uh, right now it's it's Camilla's turn. Um. So yes, this is Camilla. Look at her sipping on her tea. That goes back to that reading that I did that um, Camilla is going to tell Charles it's Her Harry or me. And it is just really inching and inching and inching along that way. Because the last reading I did is they are they are asking Charles for money. They are, without a doubt. My sources say, my sources are telling me they're asking Charles for money. Well, my sources also tell me that Camilla's had enough of them. And I think she's drawn a line in the sand. And um, and here we have with the devil and the angel, she's drawn a line in the sand. And even look at this, this, this card is a line. And, uh, and, and said it's, it's, you either start to take away their titles or start to show them they're no longer welcome. Or it's going to create problems with us. Two of Swords. Yeah, you know what? The, people were just stubborn not to take it off for a long time. They didn't want to really look at that. Uh, Page of Cups, Upright. Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Ten of Cups in reverse. Knight of Swords, Upright. Knight of Wands in reverse. We're going to get some really attacking here. We're going to get some attacking, attacking, um, 
on the internet. We're going to get some real troll stuff going on here. We're going to get some PR, some PR. I think at some point they wanted to be quiet about this, but because now that, that those HRH has come away, it's like the, I'm almost getting a, a sense of someone saying, you drew first blood. Now I'm going to come after you. Now I'm going to come and get you. You just wait. I've got some surprising news for you. I got some surprising news for you, and it's going to upset the family. Kind of cups in reverse. Uh, Knight of Wands, isn't that interesting? The uh, reading I did about Botswana, the, the reading ended with Knight of Wands. You're stuck with me, baby. You're stuck with me. Because remember, um, uh, Megan is a fire sign, so she is a wand. Uh, you're stuck with me. You're stuck with me. Like it or lump it. Like it or lump it. You're stuck with me. Yeah, look at that. I got my wish. I got my wish. I got my knight in shining armor. I didn't get William. And I kind of regret that I that I picked Harry. Because this is going, oh, I love to see this. Ten of swords. This is going to ruin. This is going to ruin her. Again, I want to point out, I can't remember, I think this is the fourth or fifth reading I've done in a row. Harry hasn't shown up at all. Harry has not shown up at all. Megan, Camilla, um, King of Swords, uh, William. Where's the Hermit? Where's the Knight of Pentacles? Where's even the King of Pentacles? Page of Pentacles. They aren't together. Sorry. They are not together. They are not. And, and William keeps showing up in reverse here. He has blocked them every which way. There's no way that any of them have any communications with William uh, at all. And this is, I don't know how many readings I've done that King of Swords shows up in reverse. And I explained why William is my king of swords. If you're new here, he is born on the cusp of, uh, of, of Gemini and Cancer. And uh, I've always read him as a king of swords. Um, and, and his father is a water sign, so his father's king of cups. So that's just to differentiate. I tell my deck that, that William is, is king of swords and um, Charles is the king of cups. Uh, so I don't, so the, so I'm not confused who the players are, but we got a 10 of swords here. The end is near. The end is near. All right. Well, thank you very much. That, that's a wrap. And thank you very much for watching. I appreciate your time. Take good care. We'll see you online. Bye for now.